Yeah, well, it, it sort of paid off to a degree. We uh, had high aspirations before we came to Australia for the GC. Um, we didn't start off very well with a, a prologue in the rain. Uh, yesterday also wasn't great. We weren't able to go with the first five. And we just sat back and looked at it and said, look, what's going on? What happened? Uh, why did he lose time yesterday? I think he got a little bit nervous. He, he, uh, yeah, he just sort of locked up a little bit uh, going in there. I said, look, today is all about the stage. Let's just forget about the GC for the moment. And uh, went for the stage and, that, and that's the way it panned out. Well, I don't know. We'll have to sit back and look at things. You know, Jay's a, a fantastic bike rider. They, the UAE uh, team did a fantastic job today as well. And so we've got to sit back and look at things calmly, uh, in, a, in, a, in a sort of calm fashion. But in all reality, I said that what I said with them this morning, let's, let's just go for the stage. That will bring a, a, a general classification along in, in that order. You know, I'd rather uh, run fifth and win a stage than run uh, fourth and, and no stage. And so that was the way it was today. Obviously going into the second, basically the same time as Yatesy, uh, second, third, that's fine, but uh, it'll, it'll be, if we can hang on to that, that'd be great. Um, but I don't know really if we can aspire to anything better than that. I knew uh, at 500 metres at the top, uh, B of, I was getting radio information from someone I had put on the climb, and uh, I knew he was around the mark. Uh, he was riding a little bit within himself at that point, and I knew that he had it in him to, to catch Jay. Uh, and then once I knew that uh, Yatesy was there as well, another fantastic bike rider, a great descender. I knew that the two of them put their heads together, and so along with Jay, uh, yeah, they, they, the three of them rode. Apparently, I didn't see it, but apparently they rode really well to the finish, and they committed to each other until the last kilometre, and then went on for, went for the stage run after that. I said to Pio about the, what would happen with uh, if Yates got to the, he got to the finish with Yates. Yates uh, Simon actually beat him in a stage win in the Tour de France a few years ago, and so he wasn't looking forward to that. But I think we talked about different scenarios, and I think we, we've we've nutted it out. Okay. Well, we'll watch uh, the lofty stage of interest, I suppose. Yep. yep. Let's be there. We'll be in for a fight. It's fair to say you're getting like a cheese <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>